It is Tuesday, March 28th, and they say this is my rebirth day, that I might remember this day for the rest of my life. It is Tuesday, April 4th, day 7 of this hospital. It is Thursday, April 6th. Here's what I know so far. Day 8 of testosterone. Woman and man are archetypes for whom gender is meaningful. Day 15 of T. Masculine and feminine are unattached to the aforementioned. Day 18 of testosterone. Gender is a social construct, particular to time and Day 36 of Masculine testosterone. Masculine and feminine are divine and exist in everyone. Masculine and feminine are meaningless and non Day 57 labels. of testosterone. Trans as a prefix means moving Day away. 75. We are always moving towards day and away 82 and of testosterone. Day 105 of testosterone. testosterone day 113 of testosterone. Day 117 day testosterone. Day 127 of testosterone. Day 134 of testosterone. Being on hormones is not required. Day 164 of testosterone. Especially trans. Day 169 If I find ways to use this prefix, can I claim it as my own? I ask, where is my voice? Where is my voice? Where is my voice? With me all along, but can you hear me yet? Can you hear me yet? I'm supposed to write a poem right now. Then I will tear it apart. I stutter because I want to make it impersonal, but this manila folder on my desk keeps staring at me. I'd like to pretend it means something. That in going this far, I have become trans enough. How will I substitute this? Maybe this journey towards a way the prefix doesn't actually specify direction is just an ongoing argument for external validation. I know it doesn't have to be that way. In this poem, I have used the word I ten times. Tell me this isn't self-absorbed. Tell me everyone is on a journey of becoming and no one is done transitioning. Tell me we just talk more about our journeys because they can often be more visible. Tell me my trans is in the right direction. Tell me it's not all in my head. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Right. The letter in the folder uses my birth name. I could make some deal out of this, but it is my professional name after all. The letter never once messes up a pronoun. It uses words like strongly and persistently, desire, desire to be, be less feminine, feminine, a 21-year-old biological female, androgynous identity, significant mind-body conflict, gender queer, non-binary, demi-boy, gender neutral pronouns, pronouns masculine, masculine attitudes, goals for transition, significant reduction of personal distress, criteria for gender identity, insights and goals for transition, presents as non-binary in areas of school work and social circles, not fully disclose their gender identity or goals for transition with their parents, parents align their physical align their appearance physical with their psychological with their identity, psychological increase the likelihood of being gender 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 gender
It's in my throat. An itch. Like, I have to keep clearing it? Or drinking water? A weight. Like everything yet unsaid is collecting there. Preparing the chords for song. I returned to the railroad tracks because I thought I would meet someone there. Brown hair swinging in the wind, blue dress and bare feet waving at me. She wasn't there though. I think I left her on a vision quest. Sitting in the woods with twigs in her earth-tangled hair, reflecting jungles in her eyes, crouching by the river, sharpening a knife. She flits out like candle flame if you look too closely at her. Instead, I stare into the eyes of Pei. Into the deep of the Stalking the crest of Pei. An impish grin on his face. changing fluid motions of understanding and identities. I would surrender to mystery between my atoms, rejoice in the unknowing as a way of becoming again and again. If I could, I would accept this body as is, as grows. Without injecting my shape-shifting into its biology. Sometimes even I do accept her. It is only by outside, the others looking on, that I fear I will never be seen in entirety. I am not substituting this journey. I am not forsaking my past. I am not letting go of my feminine. I am reverently listening to all parts of me. I am making room for my contradictions. to be good. You only have to stay. Stay. Stay, love. 
patient, patient with your becoming. With your becoming. You, are you are the God. God. Trace the circuits of time, lean into divine, softly surrender our animals. 